Now this is total cork sniffing, but if you want your Gibson guitar, in other words, your Les Paul SG335 to be more vintage and historically accurate, you may consider investing into one of these truss rod covers. If you look at the white outline around the one on the right in my hands, you'll notice that it's pretty thin. This is what Gibson typically puts on like their 50s and 60s standard models. But the one on the left with a thicker white border is what Gibson puts on their custom shop guitars. And it also came on the original vintage guitars. Unfortunately, these things are not cheap. And for whatever reason, you can't find the Gibson licensed version online anywhere these days. However, there are other manufacturers that have them available. I got mine at mojoaxe.com and believe it or not, it was reasonably priced at about $35. And as a bonus, the tone is amazing. It's woody, but not woolly. Chimey, but not ice picky. Bell-like, sweet, shimmery, throaty, glassy, transparent.